Okay, so this, this is my favorite screen right here. This is what I want to see all the time. Also, uh, I got this workaround working just in time to still collect my insurance, so that's pretty awesome. This is going to be a brief explanation for people who are encountering the install issue where you get zero, zero megabytes or seven to seven megabytes for that 12.7 update. Today's September 12th. So it's uh, within that 12.7 uh, work frame that that update is giving people an issue with seven of seven megabytes instead of 24 of 24 you're supposed to have. So somebody found a workaround through the system files and they found it on Reddit. So this is gonna come from about 10 months ago. It's ZZ Sames. I can't pronounce the name, but 10 months ago. Okay, so almost a year ago and you're gonna go and follow these directions right here it's pretty straightforward but there's a teeny tiny little bit of nuance that i found that needs to be articulated just a tad for less technically inclined people such as myself so uh and then the big post is in here about a day ago um the whole technical update yada 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 about why these issues are coming up so i'm sure battle will get to it but for now people have had to find their own thing out and they use this one from 10 months ago so here's what you're gonna do uh, I left the files open. So you're, you're going to go to your PC, you're going to go to your local files or your local disk, wherever your OS is, Windows, System32, Drivers, etc. Okay, and then you're going to go to this hosts file right here. And then what you want to do, and what I did, is you're just going to drag it to your desktop. It's going to say, hey, you need administrator privilege. Yep, continue, do that. And then you're going to double click. You're going to open it with notepad alternatively you can open it with notepad plus plus notepad worked fine for me but yes open with notepad Click okay you're going to add this line right here this line is not here when you open it originally you're going to add that in so you're going to put the ip then you're going to tab not space not tab and you're going to put the cdn-11 eft store.com thing and then you're going to just do file and save and that's it don't save as nothing like that file save because if you do save as it's going to make it a text file and it won't work just do save and when you're done with that, drag this host file back in here. The administrator privileges, yep, that's what I wanna do. And it puts it right back in there. See how it's a file, not a text file. So then minimize this, open your EFT folder, click install, and it should work. It'll go through the whole process and you should have no problems. If you do have a problem, which some people still have a problem that won't, they're having the same issue, it's probably a different issue for you. Most people, this is a good solution for them. Some people are having issues still but then you click play you know and the whole thing should launch i've done this i've clicked play five six seven times and i'm able to get into uh, i did a quick raid as a scab and things like that's working out fine no disconnect issues nothing like that so hopefully that works if i didn't clarify it enough um i'm trying to make this quick so you're not sitting here all day reading a video or whatever but uh leave some comments or shoot me an email or what, go to reddit and be like hey what the hell did you do go to instagram what the hell did you do find me somewhere and I'll try and look at what I did in the video and explain whatever step you're looking for. So hopefully this helps you a tiny bit. Uh, good luck, because this took me like, I don't know, a long time. And I was ripping out the uh, minimal hair I have left because my hair is thinning, but nonetheless, I was repairing out. So good luck. <laughs> Let me know if you need help.